Good evening, and tonight is ladies' night. And as you can see, I am in my pajamas and I'm comfortable. And we tend to think better when we're comfortable. So we can have a pajama party tonight. But what I'm gonna be talking about is quick party planning 101. So I have a friend who has a birthday on Thursday and I wanna plan a get together. And you say, Thursday? How can you have the time to do that? You work all week, you have commitments after work. That's not possible. Well, I'm gonna tell you it is possible and you can do it and still make your party simply sensational. One, the breakdown. Where's it gonna be? What time is it gonna happen? And who are you inviting? So I know it's gonna be at my house. I know it's gonna be at eight because she gets off at five, gives her time to get home, get settled and come to my house as well as our other guests. And we are gonna invite our two besties within our circle. Number two, the theme. So we are gonna do wind down and wings. So remember, you don't always have to do something that's high energy. It's a Thursday, we go to work the next day. So we are gonna do something low energy. So we're gonna have different varieties of wine as well as ordering some gourmet wings from a local restaurant because she loves gourmet. And we are just going to have a relaxing but fun birthday party. Number three, decor and energy. Entertainment. So remember, we are doing a low-key birthday party. So I have some beautiful throw pillows and throw blankets for each guest, as well as a basket full of goodies. We have custom happy birthday wine glasses, as well as chocolates and some candles, some beautiful parting gifts. You know I love parting gifts. And then for entertainment, I have some friendship conversation starter activity cards. So in ladies' night, we'll have those available soon. But those cards just allow us to get up and do some fun challenges as well as reminisce on fun moments with our friend with the birthday girl and also talk about our goals together for our friendship Number four execution so my suggestion is to always set up the night before if possible especially when you're having small get-togethers in your home and that may not mean that you're going to set everything out but at least have everything readily available that you can pull it out but if you can set things out just make sure that area is off limits to whoever else is in your house so when you get off of work that evening all you have to do is just rearrange a little bit and the party is ready and just wait for your guests to come. Thank you for tuning in for my quick party tutorial and you can tune in every Sunday night at nine for Ladies Night Indie Blog and just know that we make a simple party sensational.